Hot News YouTube channel is what you're watching. Welcome aboard. Now, Mario Barrios defends uh, Tank Davis for choosing uh, uh, Lamont Roach. Mario Barrios came to WBA lightweight uh, champion Jovanta Tank Davis's defense for his selection of uh, Lamont Roach for his next fight on December 14th. Barrios says uh, Jovanta Tank Davis, who is now at... Uh, 30 fights, no losses, 28 knockouts, has proved himself enough during his 11-year uh, career to call the shots to fight anyone he wants, just like Canelo Alvarez is doing now. The two-division world champion Barrios, 29 fights, 2 losses, 18 knockouts, who has knocked out... Uh, 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 he was knocked out in the 11th round by uh, Tank Davis, I think three years, about three years ago, that is in 2021, he feels that uh, the super featherweight uh, Roch, Lamont Roch, who is at uh, 25 fights, one loss, one draw, 10 knockouts, isn't a bad fight. And it's a really entertaining fight. Barrios is a PBC fighter, just like uh, uh, Tank, uh, Tank, uh, his, his own. Uh, 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 manager but uh, he deals with uh, various people and uh, some of the people that he's in a, a business relationship uh, with uh, it is PBC so it's um, unclear if uh, uh, Barrios is being uh, a team player because they are both linked to the PBC uh, now, uh, you, you can't clearly tell if uh, he's just being a team player with his favorable comments about uh, his uh, mismatch against Roach. Like Tank, Barrios has been well maneuvered by his management, being steered into two division world titles without beating um, any notable opponent um, yeah, during his 11 year uh, professional career. Barrios was elevated to WBC Weight Champion recently outside of the ring by uh, the World Boxing Council. In other words, Barrios is what fans call an email champion. Uh, you've heard of that uh, with uh, so many fighters out there. Uh, probably uh, in the most previous years, uh, Devin Haney was called an email champion. So uh, you, you can uh, tag that to to Mario Barrios, uh, he won his WBC interim 147 uh, pounds tight against uh, Udenis Yugas on September 30th, 2023. That was after Yugas had uh, been softened uh, by Eros Spence, losing to him by a 10th round knockout on April 16th, 2022, in a grueling fight that involved uh, the Cuban fighter sustaining. A lot of punishment. It is so surprising to see uh, yeah, people uh, talking of how Eros Pence uh, did soften uh, uh, Yudenis Hugas. And uh, after saying that, they go on to say that uh, uh, Terence Crawford fought a softened uh, Eros Pence. So, because all that was done after that accident. And uh, at one moment in that fight, Udenis Hugas looked like um, uh, he, he looked nearer to getting that uh, knockout against Eros Pence. I think Eros Spence did uh, pick out his uh, usual uh, trick of uh, uh, throwing the gum shield out of the mouth. And uh, so in, in that instance, such instances, the referees have to stop the, the, the fight and uh, uh, allow the fighter to get back the gum shield into his mouth. So, uh, guys should be giving credit to what Terrence Crawford did to Errol Spence. And uh, now, uh, that should be softening. Uh, Terrence Crawford softened Errol Spence and you doubt if uh, he's ever going to be the same fighter <clears throat> again. And it, it was more of that dominant defeat. Just like you saw Dibua beat up on Joshua. But you, you see, Joshua didn't do much of the things he's been known to do in that squared circle. But for Errol Spence, he came with his A game. He was doing the things he was used to doing, but 
just that Terence Crawford was uh, uh, the better guy on the night. But Mario Barrios, um, uh, the guy that is defending uh, Tank Davis for fighting against Lamont Roach, uh, will be defending his WBC World Away title against um, uh, number eight ranked Abel Ramos, who is at uh, 28 fights, six losses, two draws, 22 knockouts on the undercard of the Mike Tyson versus uh, Jack Paul on November 15th at uh, the AT and uh, T Stadium in Arlington, uh, Texas. Ramos has uh, a one-two record in his last uh, three fights. This is an example of Barrios being uh, well managed by his management. Why is Barrios facing uh, a fighter with that kind of record for a title defense, uh, if you may ask? But uh, because of uh, the good management, you, you, you understand where that uh, uh, comes uh, from. But uh, uh, he went on to say, uh, speaking to the media about uh, Jovanta Tank's uh, mindset towards the backlash he's getting from people over him choosing super featherweight uh, Lamont Roach to defend his WBA lightweight title on December 14th in Houston. He said, I know Tank goes uh, fuck the boxing fans. What Barrios uh, isn't saying is that uh, by Tank continually, uh, continuously uh, taking easy fights against opposition um, that fans uh, don't want to see. He's uh, stunting his popularity and not making the kind of money he could be getting if he fought better competition. Being uh, protected results into a fighter never attaining true superstar uh, status and uh, your, your, your aims of uh, entering that Hall of Fame after your career is over are also put in doubt everyone is always so opinionated boxing fans are so hard to please it doesn't matter who you fight said barrios who's making an easy defense of his wbc 147 belt against abel ramos a fighter who has lost uh, uh, two out of his uh, last three fights so it's more of the same. Uh, these guys are under PBC. And uh, Barrios uh, does seem to suggest that Tank is that superstar level. You, you see, his resume uh, that, that doesn't uh, talk superstar. But he's a superstar because he was made a superstar by uh, the Mayweather promotion team. And uh, so he has to prove uh, to the world that uh, he's indeed that superstar, not only out of that squared circle, but also in that squared circle, got a good win against uh, Ryan Garcia, but he still has to fight more elite opposition for him to comfortably walk into that uh, Hall of Fame, Boxing Hall of Fame, after he's through with his boxing career. Do place your comment in the comment section below. I sign out. Peace.